Welcome to the Week in Review at the Nebraska Department of Education. I'm David Jesperson, Public Information Officer for NDE. Thank you so much for watching this brief update. The goal over the next few minutes is to fill you in on some of the news, notes, and events that have happened involving NDE. And we'll start with a very busy state board meeting. Every month, the public is invited to share their comments with the board. And December's meeting was filled with thoughts on the proposed civic readiness draft. Several citizens took time to express their concerns and show their support for the definition. State Senator Mike Groney, chair of the Education Committee at Nebraska's legislature, offered his critique as well. The debate also received some attention in the media. The board opted to hold off on any action until the public comments can be weighed and NDE staff has time to make any edits that may be necessary. The board will have a chance to take action on the definition at an upcoming meeting. This week, educators from across the state came together to talk science at Innovation Campus in Lincoln. NDE staff helped lead the conversations at the Nebraska Science Summit. The goal was to find new ways to get kids in all grade levels excited about science using those new science standards. The summit grabbed some media attention as well. Channel 8 came out and interviewed Sarah Cooper about the big event. Another big event happened this week, the Winter Employee Recognition. NDE staff gathered at the Masonic Temple for some food and fun. The commissioner thanked everyone for their hard work and helped honor NDE staff that have hit milestone anniversaries within the department. Some lucky staff won door prizes and others earned some rewards with an ugly sweater contest. And everyone was treated to a great performance by the Lincoln Southeast Jazz Band. Finally this week, another education topic that grabbed a lot of local headlines. State senators toured the state visiting schools to find out how districts are dealing with reading and dyslexia. The tour ended at Lincoln at a couple of LPS schools. Senators Luann Linehan and Patty Panzing Brooks also met with the commissioner to talk about possible legislation moving into 2018. Thank you so much for tuning in to this Week in Review. We'll see you next week with the latest news from NDE.